Hello viewers, I am Kajul and you are watching Tech Passport and today I am going to show you how to set up help text and customer support ticketing system. So if you have any uh, customer related company or customer related uh, job then you want to set up your customer support ticketing system. So viewers, at first you want a hosting service or a domain name with a domain name. If you don't have hosting service, uh, if you have real IP, then you should install it to your own computer. Uh, next time I am show you how to install your own computer. But now in this time I am show you how to install it in your cPanel. So I am logging with my dashboard in client area in my hosting server. So now I am clicking to cPanel. Click to cPanel. After click to cPanel, click to uh, then uh, I am going to scroll down and make a subdomain here you can see the domain and here you can see the subdomain here you can see the subdomain sorry here you can see the subdomain and here you can see the domain so now we are making a subdomain because I don't want to create directly domain with the support system not directly uh, make it on my directly domain name so i'm click the support i'm previously write the support and change my second email, uh, domain name it's hoihullos.fun and create click it might be take uh, some moment in my case it's take a very short time then i'm going to tools and then then I'm scroll down and I am select the uh, TTL SSL uh, SSL status then I am going to see SSL status and I am run the SSL status again you can see here support and support hoi holders fun not SSL is included so I am run it again and wait some moment viewers you can see here my cell uh, progress is done and then you can see here the three point and uh, uh, sorry the support hoihulus.fun and ww support hoihulus fun ssl is added then i am again go back to tools and scroll down to find the software you can see here the software in middle of the domain panel is the software okay you can see here the software okay then i'm found find the software class apps installer you can see here the software class apps installer then you click the software class apps installer after click the software class apps installer you can now find the customer support here you can see the customer support in the left area customer support you can see here the customer support customer support because we are installing the customer support system so i am coming the customer support here you can see the lot of script a lot of software here for the customer support but today I am only overview or review with the open support system here you can see the open support system here you can see the open support system it's simple and open source ticketing system if you have any uh, kind of ISP service provider or any type of product related uh, uh, customer service then you can easily install it for your customer support system if you have courier system if you have bus system bus ticketing system then uh, if your customer wants to directly uh, uh, conversation with the with their problem then it's very useful to install so it's completely free so i am going to click how to show you how to install it in my case i am very bad for english language so please forgive me that the way install now click i am clicking the install now here you can see the install now button and clicking the install now after clicking the install now you can see here the uh, domain name 
section which domain you install it then click the support which one i want to install it the support ticket system and delete the slash system slash slash directory so i am um, select the support who you loads dot fun and here is i am um, write the uh, our service name suppose as customer su customer support sorry the spell mistake customer support dot fun okay here is i am select my site name and here you can see the admin user you can change it admin to your name and here is uh, write your email address which one you want any anything you can uh, use like uh, gmail or uh, uh, anything else so i am copy it and here you can at the rate uh, 234 i am using this password for the tutorial passport uh, purpose you can change it as you want and then at the last option you can select your language if you want to change any language uh, here here the lot of language hindi italian japan polish this software have the multi language supported so you can change here the any any kind of language sorry it's not available in bangla then you can write here your email address if you write here your email address then all credentials send your email address like your username like your admin email address like your password if you forget it uh, after 10 days or after two days or sometimes later then you can open this email and since what's inside after then you click the install here you can see the install when you click the install it's take a bit of minute and one more uh, error is coming here you can see here the php version is uh, downgrade so it's need to upgrade the PHP uh, version so it asks about uh, upgradation and you, uh, you have to give the permission then it's a uh, click the install after give the permission and click the install it's take a few seconds like 20 or 30 seconds in my case it's uh, take 10 seconds and here is you can see the access urls here is the um, normal user panel url and here is you can see the admin url so let's go to see how is the um, user panel here like a uh, user how to use your customer C and here you can see the customer uh, panel here and uh, customer uh, needs to sign up their account here I am uh, use the customer name so trust one two like your customer id or you can uh, you can uh, tell about your customer uh, use their name and here you can here i am use abc at the red mail.com like temporary mail and here i am use one two three four five six one two three four five six like a demo account great sign up and you can see the sign up process is done and here i am going to um, uh, access this uh, user account uh, username is abc at the way to gmail.com and here is password one two three four five six uh, so here uh, so viewers you can see here uh, the customer panel is open and if the customer wants to create a ticket then here is the create a ticket view the articles edit profile customer can change their profile and customer can close the session okay then i am going to abc at gmail.com and again one two three four five six i am going to log in and then now i am going to create a demo ticket here is the ticket and the, write the subject title demo 
デモ D D I C K demo ticket and department help and support you can customize on your admin panel department change and here you can write I am write just demo uh, panel demo text demo text or demo complain okay no need to uh, inform your uh, customer ID because uh, our customer name because you sign up with the customer ID or customer name okay then upload anything uh, error in your system then upload file if you want anything I'm just um, upload a demo image and create the ticket okay it's done so now I'm, uh, now I am going to uh, open the admin panel here is the admin panel and sorry here is the admin panel sorry 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 here is the admin panel I am going to integration window then admin panel is open here is the email address uh, here is the email address admin uh, when I am install uh, it's the admin uh, at the rate support dot fun and password password at the rate one two three four and password at the rate one two three four login then you can see here the admin panel is uh, here and all notifications all notifications you can see the customer sign up one cast 12 and cast 12 created ticket okay we are going to see the customer email address and customer details okay then here you can click the all notification here is the customer ticket here you can see the customer ticket here is a demo ticket and you can see here the demo ticket demo text or demo complaint and if you want to reply then you can reply here and reply then your customer get the response ticket reply and if you go to your customer support uh, tab then you can see the re uh, refresh and you can see the customer what you reply here customer can see your reply here is the reply that's all and here you can see the customer send you an image and you can see the image in the customer what you send uh, if you want to see that then you might must it be downloaded then you can see this image okay then uh, other setting we are going to users you can uh, uh, now you can see how much users is um, uh, sign up with your this uh, customer cause uh, ticketing system here is the article uh, and you, you can topic the article you can um, uh, B I L L I N G billing here you can uh, add the billing and then click uh, save article and here you can add uh, the customer support uh, agent here you, you can add the customer support agent here name and email address and help and support which support department is uh, they handle then you can uh, the all department all department help and support and uh, department you can add the department add new department sorry that's the that's not department here is a department add department here you can see the billing B I L L I N G billing and then the department is so viewers you can change um, your admin emails from here advanced settings and you can upload the include user via cpa uh, csv and backup database and delete all users and you can uh, settings the custom tag here is the custom tag and here you can uh, here you can click the my account and change the uh, update departments here you can see the update departments and then you can see here the department is second department is available so might be it take some moment view article click and okay it might be take some moment update Jet. then you can change here your, your image if I am going to change emails then you can say here 
I am change this in as. Okay, that's all. And if you have any questions, then ask me in my uh, comment box below. And uh, if you have, if you think I am uh, going to mistake something or I am don't uh, uh, tell you uh, something, then uh, must be. Uh, tell me in my comment box i'm trying to fix up in in my next video uh, have a good day and thank you very much and if you think uh, in with this video you have to uh, in some uh, i help you some something then please hit the subscribe button and stay tuned with my channel have a good day thank you very much